Yo guys, welcome back to Forza Horizon. So we're going to do one exhibition and then we'll move on to two street races. And also, we're going to have a showcase event in this episode. I didn't even notice that, but we almost have enough fans for the next showcase. So we're going to go ahead and continue on with that. I have no idea what this new showcase is going to be, but depending on the picture, I'm going to guess what it is. Like the other one, I was like, oh, there's a picture of a train. Maybe it's a, a race in a train. So I guess we'll find out. Uh, no spoilers. So let's go ahead and do it. And this is going to be absolutely epic because I want to do street races in this too. So we're just doing a good exhibition. Uh, again, our car doesn't have the best handling. I probably should have brought my Audi for this, but dude, that guy just like tried to wipe me out. <laughs> just rear-ended me and tried to take me out. Now I'm losing. Oh well, we're still doing okay. I'll try to overtake him right here. These are all pretty fast cars. Oh boy. All right, here we go. They're all pretty evenly matched, though. I mean, they're all kind of the same type of cars. Not really super. They're actually, they actually, these are actually are considered supercars in this class. Here we go. These are all kind of luxurious at the same time, which is kind of cool. Fifth place, this is some good gains right there. There's a drift zone right here. So maybe that's a decoration, I don't know. Get this checkpoint. Ah, oh, crap, we're spinning out. <laughs> I don't, I feel like I don't have traction control or stability. I'm not, I think it's traction. My, my car's not. There we go. It's finally getting it going now. Has a hard time accelerating when you're not going straight. It sucks it off road. Oh my god. It doesn't grip at all. I like my Audi. I'm going to start driving my Audi again. This Mercedes is a lot better for traveling, though. It goes a lot faster. It's pretty good at drifting, too. The Audi's more of a grip car. This is more about drifting. There's three laps though, so maybe we can make some gains. Oh crap, what, what, what am I doing? There we go. This is kind of like losing control for a second. I'm losing control! That's yeah, just definitely a lot more drifty. I don't like that, I like grip. Here we go. I wish Forza Horizon 3 had a off-road spec too. It's like certain cars are better for off-roading, blah blah blah. I mean, any car can off-road in this game, but the off-road cars do it so much better. So there's so much more ground clearance. Oh boy. Hope I don't lose it again. Got some decent combos going too. This is a fun race. It's a nice mixed surface. Probably better car. There's a lot better cars than this that could do mixed surfaces though. Especially since I have 1500 horsepower. <laughs> I can't believe I have that much. This, it still doesn't act like S1500, but it does act like they'll, they'll want them going really, really fast. And since I think tire wear simulation's on, you know, when I do drifts and go really fast, the tires are going to wear out, so... I mean, I can tell I'm losing grip. Here we go. It's telling me the brake up here, but you don't really need the brake that much. You just kind of slide through like that. Alright, we're doing pretty good now. I'm getting used to this course. Oh, that was too wide. Too late of a break. Lost our spoiler. That ain't good. A lot of damage to our back right. Let's keep going. Overall, not too much damage, though. Oh, we should have smashed that fence. Oh, my God. I, I don't think I really even hit that tree. It's like, boom. Oh, man, I missed that checkpoint. I don't think we did. Still counting, so... Oh, am I gonna miss this one? I am, like, taking so many shortcuts in this race. It's insane. Let's keep on going. I'm almost done here. This is a nice straightaway from here. And then one more turn. Ah, crap. See what I mean, guys? This thing is just hard to control. I'm, like, just... I'm, like, swerving everywhere trying to keep this thing under control. I do like a challenge, though. Ooh, that was nice. That was really nice. That was an awesome drift around the turn. Yeah, this thing's pulling to the right. Okay, there we go. That was a good race. Looked pretty decent. I think that guy was about a second behind me. Two seconds. Almost two seconds. <sighs> that went pretty good. Looks like some of these other people got some damage. 13,000 credits. Got some XP. I think Vezono is playing as we speak because I saw his XP still going up. I haven't passed him in the leaderboard yet. Join my clan if you haven't already. Hey, Colin. 
Ready to put on another driving showcase? Oh. This one was my idea. No Had way. Had to call in some favors, but it should be like nothing Horizon has ever seen before. Which is why we're here, after all. Here's the start line. I'll see you there. No way. 410,000 fans. Turn around when it's just safe to For do so. racing a bow. Question, this is probably a really fast bow. Hey, it's Fezono. We should go subscribe to his channel, by the way. Big shout out to him. Love that guy. He's, he's been my friend for a very long time. You know, I take my online friends as seriously as my real life friends, and we just all have a good time. Just all enjoy each other's company. Oh boy. <laughs> I wanted to get through, but there was traffic too, so I was like, eh. Well, we've probably destroyed somebody's car. <laughs> There's Vezono once again. Let's see if we can start a convoy of him. Nope, we started a convoy. Awesome. Do convoys give you any benefits? I Listen guess they're just for fun. This is Hospital Records Radio telling you to get down to the Yarra Valley right now. Oh man, I can't wait for this boat race. Again, I want to fit in the street races into this episode. Don't I don't think we will be it. able to. Sorry win. guys, I lied. Maybe. Man, this, the rain kills my FCS on this. Holy cow. Quick. Keep it I'm not used to right playing on 30s. This looks very, really laggy to me. Even though it's not. Turn right. Break. You can tell the game's starting to slow down. Hold on, I'm gonna adjust some settings real quick. Okay, for some reason I had MSAA on four times, which I don't even need MSAA on. I put, turned it down to two. Don't even see a difference because I am playing in 4K, so. I've been watching the videos, by the way, and they don't look like they're that great of quality. I really do apologize for that. It's because, you know, with my recording situation for this game, Windows doesn't think it's a game for some reason. Like, it doesn't detect it. Convoy race? No. Okay. I like the Volvo that he's driving. Seems like it handles pretty well. Oh boy. The roads are still slippery. That's running a little bit better. I also turn that shop and go down the 4 times instead of 16 times. Still don't see a difference. The shadows in this game have a very low, like, rendering distance. That's, that's how the console handles this game. The render distance is insanely low. Like all the shadows and stuff. This runs pretty well in 4K. My friend was running it on low the whole time. And I'm like, dude, you have a GTX 980. Max the crap out of it. And he did. And it's still, he still gets 60 FPS. Solid. My 1080 is about double the power of his 980. So, in 4K even I can max it out. Except with the filters turned down. So, yeah, it works pretty well. It's optimized pretty decent. I heard a lot of people have issues running it though. It is really CPU and RAM heavy, which is kind of weird. I'm also using like using like 6.5 gigs of VRAM right now, so it's VRAM heavy. Like my laptop can run in a medium. It's got a 960M. It's got an i7 5700 HQ processor, 12 gigs of RAM. And that thing uses almost all of its VRAM, and it's running on medium settings. I have to turn the resolution down very slightly too. It looks okay on medium. There's a big difference between high and ultra in this game just because of how the textures and all the shadows and reflections are rendered and the render distance. Alright. Holy cow, this thing goes so fast. We have to break really early. Turn left. <laughs> I really need to get a hyper car. So we can get the places really quick with good handling. Get some air time. Woo! Whoa! The Zono going crazy over here. All right, here comes a boat race. Let's do it. Do do. Oh my gosh, he just crashed. You have arrived at your destination. River Run. Let's do it. All right. Oh, we get this giant Baja truck. I thought, what's the fastest thing on earth without wings or wheels? So you're racing a team of power boats. You No. Here we go. Don't embarrass me. No. I don't like this. Gotta go fast. I think we can cheat a little bit here, although we got checkpoints still. Oh my god, they go so fast. This is a very nice truck. What truck is this? Is this a Toyota? I know it's a Baja truck, but what exactly is it? Okay, we gotta hit some land, that way we can get faster. This thing can go through deep water. This thing looks awesome, by the way. I remember, uh, I remember looking at it on Xbox and it wasn't as detailed. We're in position two, that's not good. 
Got to get some more speed going on here. Oh boy, don't tell me we're going to hit those. Okay, we got to rock jump. Woo! Yeah, we should be ahead of them, but we aren't. So we need to get ahead. Let's go. I don't know if I'm going to beat these guys. Okay, we're in position one. That's good. As long as we keep position one, then we're good to go. Do some off-roading on this, which is cool. Oh, position two, that's not good. Go, 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 go. These boats are super competitive. Oh no, we have to go in the water with them. That's, no, I don't, I don't wanna go through the water. It's slowing me down. Okay, we're not even halfway done yet, so that's good. Those boats are loud. I can't even hear my own car over those engines. They could, okay, it told us to brake, but we didn't. So that's good. That gives us a slight advantage. We don't have to brake here either. Just gotta take advantage of everything we can. Well, I thought we had to go over the bridge. I braked when I wasn't supposed to. Through the water. Let's see if we can get on land. Oh boy. Position two, come on, we gotta we gotta win this. Okay, we gotta straight away. Just tell me the break, but I don't have to. <laughs> More water. Isn't it just epic how we're just going through the water like they're quite a bit ahead of us actually. We should be ahead of them, but we're not. And they're fast. I don't know if I'm gonna beat these dudes. I barely beat the train last time, so. No! Smash into the wall. Smack! Okay, we're in position one. Hope they have more turns coming up. Whoa! No way! That was amazing. Yeah, that crowd better be cheering. That was awesome. Position two again. Oh gosh. I'm really not confident that we're going to beat these guys. Bezono said he did this race and he had 200 milliseconds. Oh crap. He had 200 milliseconds before uh, he won, but he had 200 milliseconds with the boats behind him. 200 milliseconds, that's just insane. Or also known as 0.2 seconds. We gotta win this. Oh my god, it's so close. Ooh. I think one of the boats was ahead, but they all have to be ahead, I believe. Amazing drive, boss. We won by no barely more than two point, uh, point two known, seconds. I might have insured you for more, but hey, it's fine. Bold one trophy are, truck. In one piece. Also, if you're wondering about the badge, that means I'm just a clan owner. I think Vizono has a badge too, meaning he's co-leader. I'm surprised we don't get more, more credits. We don't really get a lot. We've got a lot of fans though. Festival expansion is ready. We have over 1 million fans now. Awesome. I think I'm going to expand the city again. Official All fan right. club doesn't fit in our marquee anymore. Time for another site expansion. All right, let's just expand the city. Hey Colin, you might want to get down to the airstrip. We've just opened the official Horizon Australia car meet. They're all waiting for you to make an entrance. A car meet? What exactly is a car meet? Airfield car meet challenge other players to online drag races or check out their designs and tunes. Okay, that's not that interesting, honestly. I told, uh, I'm thinking about making designs myself because you can make a lot of money if, like, people use your designs and pay for them and stuff. I don't know, though. I'm not really an artist, so. But you can make some cool designs. Whoa! Rock. <laughs> Why? <laughs> that always happens. Too much traffic. I'm just kidding. There's not even. There's barely any traffic in this game. The, a, the AI traffic is really aggressive, though. The car's troubling. I want to see if we can get the better speed trap on this. It annoys me that we don't have it maxed out. All right, expand. Why won't it work? I'm just gonna spam click it until it works. Why won't you work? There we go. Level two to three. Let's see if we see a difference. We gotta look at the tents and stuff. All right. I just got off the phone with the pyrotechnics guy. It's not really much of a difference he between said, two and three. In his opinion, our stage three plans were a bit excessive. I didn't have the heart to tell him about stage four. <laughs> 
all the base. Ooh, so we got some cars on sale. Ooh, I've always wanted kind of a Corvette. Good handling score. How good is the Dodge Viper in handling? Ooh, we can afford that. Although I'd rather get a Corvette. Modern muscle. These are all muscle cars. I'm surprised the Corvette's considered muscle. Same with the Cadillac. Got a Camaro here too. I'm gonna have to go with the Corvette. It's always a car I've always wanted to kind of drive. Okay. That's like the only GM car I'm a fan of is the Corvette. Camaros are good too. Uh, colors. Let's get, let's, ooh. What about like a dark red? Like this color. Let's try black, ooh. Silver looks nice too, I like that silver. You know, I'm gonna go with the silver. Makes it look stealthy. But it still makes that black hood stand out too. Alright. Is this a back engine? I believe it is. Maybe it isn't. I don't think it is. I think it's a front engine. I forget. I think it's a front engine. If I remember correctly. Oh, I want to make this thing explode. There we go. Yeah, it's a front engine. Woo! Take a look at this engine. Look at all the level of detail. That's just insane. You think about it though, like it, it doesn't take a lot to uh, make what these cars look like. What, I lo what I've what i always loved about Forza is that they always focus on a lot of detail. Not all the cars have engines in them though. You can still review them and look at their cockpits and stuff. I mean, they do a very good job at doing all this. So we're going to go ahead and put some upgrades on this thing. We don't have much, but we can do it. Alright, here we go. Custom upgrade. Alright, look how much more horsepower we put on this thing while increasing only by 17 points. That's just awesome. And it's only gone up a little bit of weight and it goes quite a bit faster. Better acceleration, better handling, better everything. Better braking. It's got it all. So, let's do it. Alright, so we got some new events coming up. Let's get all that new stuff. Alright. What else do we got? Um, I think we already tried this one. Ooh, what's all these arrows down here? Well, that's an active championship going on. As you uh, do more shark showcases and stuff, you get a lot more fans from all these, all this stuff. All right. Um, undiscovered route. Here's a new PR stunt. Let's take out this Corvette. Let's see how it drives. Surprisingly, it accelerates pretty well. I like the handling of it. Very nice acceleration. Ooh, look at this cockpit. Look at this thing. <laughs> I like this Corvette. This might this might be my new favorite car. I don't know. Very stylish too. Holy smokes. It's an awesome car. You can't even upgrade the brakes on it. It's just got really good brakes already. It's all sports already. I'm sure people have like upgraded this to a supercar before. Yeah, look at how well it turns. This is awesome. I like it. Loving it. I could upgrade it to S2 if I wanted to. I don't like totally changing out cars though. Well, I did upgrade this. That's another two fact too. So it's probably why it's a lot better. Ooh, I see a Ferrari. Apparently it's hard. If it's hard, then we gotta try it. It's a Ferrari though. Get caught doing in a Ferrari 150 miles in a Ferrari 488 Jeep TB. Look at those lights. I'm thinking about upgrading the lights on my four Taurus because they're pretty bad. I'm sure that they sneak cleaning though. No. Alright. I was driving in the early morning and I just couldn't see that far at the lights. So let's do it. I love this car too. After driving the Mercedes Benz, getting a hold of a car that handles well is quite surprising sometimes. Ooh boy. So we gotta reach 150 miles per hour. I don't know how I'm gonna do it around a turn right there. That's gonna be oh, <laughs> that's why you gotta lo look out for hills. Holy smokes, that scared the crap out of me. Okay, now it's gone. What? So we can't really sacrifice the slow down right here, but we have to. Oh boy. Okay, so uh, what do we want to do for this? It's really crucial that we get this turn perfect. So. We didn't slow down too much. 150, 150, 150, 150, 150. 
Ah. We gotta get that turn perfect. Oh my gosh, we just did it one mile per hour over. So what I did was I did a perfect turn, didn't, barely lost any speed, and I just barely made it. I thought we weren't gonna make it, but oh my gosh. That was a hard challenge for that much credits and XP. That was not worth it whatsoever. Oh well, at least we got it done. And we get a wheel spin. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, we didn't get a car, but we got 75,000 credits. That's pretty good. And we got a lot of fans, so all right, it works. Alrighty, so we're head-to-head -head racing this guy right now. I um, guess I could take a shortcut if I wanted to, but he's right behind me, I believe. Hopefully he's not shortcutting, and I'd be screwed. I think we're good to go, though. Boy, lose control. Is he, where is he? Okay, he, I think that's him right there. He's got, like, some kind of like, Lexus S1 car. Pretty much the same stats as me. And to the finish. We got probably, what, 50,000 credits from that? Almost 50,000. Hey, that's pretty good. Alrighty. Got a lot from that. There's an XP board over there. I'm going to go ahead and smash that. Well, it's, well on the episode here, guys, I'm going to do the street races next. Uh, so let's do it. I want to get the Midnight Battle next episode. So don't forget to subscribe. Let's do some comments. Make sure to turn on your notifications for more updates and videos and stuff like that. So you can keep up with it. And we got an XP board. Awesome. We got a car nice and wet. Alright. I really like this Corvette. Sure, I hope you guys like it too. This is probably one of the most stylish vehicles ever. Like, it doesn't have an overkill design. I, I think my favorite is the back part. Let's look at those back lights. Look at those. Oh, yeah. I remember they used to make fun of uh, Corvettes back then because you can push in the back bumper like it's a cheap piece of plastic. Um, I can kind of do that on my Ford Taurus th too. You push in the plastic. But. That's all, guys, and see you later.